<laughs> right, have you got your bag, twins? Yeah, I got my sliders on. You got your sliders dance on. Dance t-shirt on. Dance t-shirt on. Toby, you ready to go? Yeah. Agnes, are you ready to go? Yeah. I've got my shorts. Have you got the bag, Leah? Yeah. Okay. Are you ready to go? Yeah. You're ready to go. Right, go on then, off you go. Let's go. Good morning everybody and welcome back to the Sullivan family. So it's a wonderful Saturday again with it's the weekend. Oh we love the weekend. Um yeah, so we're kicking the day off again with swimming. Yes, darling. Do you know dinosaurs turn into fossils? Who does? Dinosaurs. They do. What happens? They do. Dinosaurs turn turn into fossils, they really do. Yes, I know the bird speaker's still going. Remember last week we had the bird, we had the bird scarer, the bird speaker. That's still going. Yeah, what, what am I doing? What am I looking at now? Oh. There's a guy in loss of the. Okay. Yes. <laughs> oh goodness me! This, everybody wants to tell me something. So the guy with the penny farthing lives locally, I think. He goes past like some uh, Victorian gentleman. He's quite funny. Um, Bless her, Erin just fell over, so I just picked her up. You okay and you, Erin? Is your, is your arm all right? Yeah, you're all right. You're all right, it's just another war wound. Another war wound from playing and running. Yes? My scab is all right. Is your scab all right, is it? Yeah. Good. I guess the scab's okay. I'm going to stay around, we're going to stay around the house today. Apart from Zoe's going to go out later to go shopping. And, um, okay. It'll be right in the pool. Be right in the pool, don't worry. Um, watch the road. Watch the road. The pool in your yeah. out. Okay, cool. Yes. So, hang on. <laughs> right. I've tried to explain what I'm doing today, but I've run out of time. <laughs> I have. I had that bit walking down there. That's my time scale for telling you what's going on today. But I've run out of time. Right. I'm going to take them in. We're going to go swimming, and then I'll have a chat with you afterwards. All right. Okay. Okay. Okay, so that's swimming done and dusted. So what I was trying to say earlier, what I was trying to get out earlier, was the fact that we're gonna spend the day at home apart from Zoe, who's gonna go out shopping later. So Zoe's got a lot of things she wants to get done and then we're trying to, we're playing a bit of catch up. So there's a lot of things that she wants to get, to get done. Um, so uh, there's a few things that I wanna get done as well. So we've got this new baby chair that swings. So I'm gonna get that built. We've also got a new baby swing for the garden, which I wanna get up. Um, there's a few bits of tidy and I want to do around the garden just a few things like that today but what I'm going to start doing is on a Saturday because Zoe now does she now does the big shop on a Saturday excuse the wind noise again but because Zoe does a big shop on a Saturday what we what we do now is she'll go off at like around about tea time which then leads me to do the tea tea time with the kids and then bath the kids and all that kind of stuff to get tidied up so she can come back bring the big shop home and then I'll put it away for her so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a shopping haul video on our Saturday videos every week now, hopefully. So if it all pans out and Zoe keeps doing her shopping on um, on a Saturday, I'm going to be doing a, a shopping haul to finish the video off, which I thought was quite nice, actually, because it's hard for us to fit the shopping hauls in um, unless we're doing a specific one. Like Zoe's going to go to Inverness shopping with the girls and we're also going to do Agnes's birthday um, shopping hall and stuff like that, you know, but but no, I just thought it was quite nice. It might just add a little bit of an extra element to our Saturday vlog, I thought. So, yeah, uh, we all do, we'll still wait for Toby, aren't we? Yeah. So, anyway, we'll just wait for Toby a minute and then we'll be heading back up the road. I just pinched my baby off Isabel. I pinched my baby back. Thanks, Isabel. Thanks for watching her. So they're all just having a snack a minute. It's a bit windy again. It's really annoying. It's a bit windy. I'm going to have to get a microphone, I think. Makes a big microphone thing up. Let's go and find Zoe. So let's see what Zoe's up to. I just thought I'd come and say hello. Swimming was good. I, I'm not going to film you in that. It's not very flattering. <laughs> That's better. How are you doing? Fine. Are you all right? 
Swimming went okay, as per usual. There's no yeah. dramas. Joseph and Agnes are actually quite good down at the swimming pool. They've started to come down, or, or Joseph has started to come down with me on a Saturday, but he's really good. I just thought I'd nick the baby back for 10 minutes. So what are you What are you doing this morning? Because I was trying to tell everybody at home what you're doing this morning, but are you just sorting out? Have you not noticed? Oh, you've changed the bed? Cleaning it in the bedroom, yeah. Cool. She's changed the, the bed in. The baby that's never slept in the bed. Look, baby. Look, I changed your bed. Don't pinch your back. Look. I've just got her. I changed your bed. Hang on. Say no. Oh, that's cute. Look at this bed. Look, see? It's got boxes and stuff on it. That's yeah, nice, isn't it? It's nice. It's nice. See, nope. I'm not sleeping in there. I'm not sleeping in there. I don't want to sleep in there. You're so snuffly. Are you so snuffly? Right, I'm going downstairs. I'm going to go out in the garden and see what they're up to yeah. before um, we do a bit of lunch. Are you picking your nose? No, I was moving my nose. Really. I thought you were picking no. your nose. I haven't done my hair, my makeup, nothing. You come in in the bedroom and I'm. I've got a runny nose. You don't need makeup, darling. I do. You don't need makeup. You're perfect just as you are. Go on, shift it. Let me clean. <laughs> I'll see you in a bit. So I come outside and everybody goes inside, apart from Erin. Everyone's just come back inside. And I lost baby Flo. She got nabbed off me by one of the older girls. So yeah, um, all we're going to get done this afternoon is just come out in the garden, get a few little bits done. Um, hi darling, all right? Get a, get a few little bits. You do know how to ride a bike, you're right. You're really good at it. Um, yeah, go on then. We'll just, just go, go around there then. Yeah, just go around there. So yeah, I'm going to get a few things done in the garden. Um, and then Zoe, later on, when she's finished, she's going to go off to Tesco's, like I told you earlier. But um, I'm going to go and do some lunch, I think. It's about that sort of time. Yeah, let's do some lunch. Right, while we've got five minutes, we're making the new swing chair for can baby I, Florence, aren't we? Can yeah? I open it? Yeah. Can I open it? You can, right, be very careful, okay? So this is, let me just tell you what this is. This is a cuggle, cuggle, I'll show you. Right, we're not sponsored, but... We're not sponsored or anything, but I just thought I'd show you what it is anyway. So it's one of these that... Cargo baby swing chair, can you see that? Yeah, it's got yeah. sweets on it. Yes, so we're going to make that now, so. Yes. In fact, in fact, I might just time lapse this, this little bit and get back to you. It's for fun. Should we time lapse? Yeah. yeah. let's time lapse. Right, there we go, that's that finished. So, right, Toby's gonna give a demonstration. Now, Joseph, Joseph, don't rock it, don't rock it. That's it, go on then, Toby, do it, give a demonstration. You Have you put the swing on? No, 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 look. Hmm? Press the button that's got swing on it. This? Yeah, that's it, that's it. Well done. How you set the music, you just press the button and press that music bit. Button. That's nice, isn't it? And then when you... Yeah. And it's got, it's got different settings for the swing as well, isn't it? It can go faster or slower. Ooh, birds. That's the duck one. Which one? That's really cool. I really like it. 
Should we get um Agnes? Should we get Agnes? Why do I keep calling Florence Agnes? Let's go should we go and get baby Florence in it? Yeah. Okay, cool. Let's see what's What do you think, Florence? What do you think? Look at the sheep. Well, I think that's a success. Yeah. Don't you think she likes it? She yeah. loves it, doesn't she? Yeah. <laughs> she really loves that swing chair. Brilliant. Right, I think we're going to go outside for some fresh air now. Yeah. After we've built that, I think that's the next best thing. So um, yeah. we'll see you out in the garden in a minute. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so we're out of the garden and that was the second thing that I wanted to get done today was the new baby swings. We've had that for a, for a few weeks now and I just wanted to put it up. So what I've done is I've taken off the old swing or the old, I think you had a climbing rope thing, didn't you? So I've taken that off and I've just put this on. We're going to give baby, we're going to give baby Flo a shot in that in a minute as well to see if she likes it. So that was the second job and the only other job that I'm doing today was that, to put that swing on. So that looks all right as well, doesn't it? Um, maybe baby Florence was a little bit too small for that, for that uh, swing just yet. Bless her, she was lost in that little swing. Okay, you want a shot of the baby swing? I'll give you a shot of the baby swing in a minute, alright? I'll give you a shot, Agnes. Agnes, I'll give you a shot in a minute, alright? <laughs> Florence, bless her, just looked like, what am I doing in here? What's going on? You're too big. No, you're way too big. Is that your snack? Yeah, and it doesn't have milk. It doesn't. Mine doesn't have milk. What snacks have you got? Have you got sweeties? Yeah, yeah. I don't have sweeties. And what snack have you got, Joseph? A chocolate bunny? Yeah. Are you kidding me? I've got a marshmallow bunny. I've got marshmallow bunny. And if you squish it, it's marshmallow. Is it milk free? No. Yes, it is. Just milk. It is milk free. Right, so it's about three o'clock in the afternoon. Zoe's just wrapping up upstairs. Um, she's going to go out to shopping in a minute and get this uh, weekly shop. So um, what I'll probably do is I'll stop the video here and then... Um, when Zoe gets back later, I'll do a bit of a, like I said before, I'll do a bit of a um, shopping haul video, I think. Yeah? Have you all had a nice day today? Yeah! Good. Yeah. Has everybody had a nice day? Yeah. Did we like building um, baby Florence's chair? That was good, wasn't it? Yeah. That was good. So, um, yeah, I'm going to leave the video here for now. And then I'll catch you a bit later on when I do the um, shopping haul. Okay, so we are Saturday night. Um, I'm back with all my shopping. I've just been and got the shopping. Um, so I've been to Asda, been to Tesco's, other way around, done the shop. Ben's going to put it all away in a minute. So um, I found that going this kind of over tea time, bedtime on a Saturday seems to work quite well because it means I don't miss out on everything. I don't miss time on Saturday afternoon. Um, by going and I don't miss out on everything on a Sunday afternoon by going so um kind of works out quite well doing it this time I've been sorting out um our bedroom today and I've been sorting out the twins older twins wardrobes um which is something I've been meaning to do for ages because we want to go on a shop shopping trip don't we to Inverness um because the girls need some new stuff it means to go through their wardrobes for ages to see what doesn't fit, what they don't wear anymore, um, what Eva might like, and just to have a good sort out, really, and put stuff away. Um, so we're kind of a bit clearer as to what we need to buy. So that was this afternoon. 
but if I go shopping in the middle of the afternoon it kind of takes up the whole afternoon and then your time's gone so it seems to work out quite well going at this time um although it's about I think it's about seven o'clock already and I know Ben wants to uh to vlog putting it all away <laughs> more for him I hate putting the shopping away I don't like going shopping very much especially when you're walking around the supermarket and everything is just so much more expensive than it was last week um it's ridiculous everything the prices on everything have just gone up by like 15 20 25p um it's just it's mental i mean like chocolate mousse they used to be in asda they were a pound for six another one pound 15 i think um bottles of pepsi max big big bottles of pepsi max were sorry it's my hand um i think they were like one pound 50 sometimes 125 on special um, and now they're £1.75 a bottle, but Tesco's have been very um, clever with how they've done it. So they've put their prices up and then next to it, they've put club card, you, you know, you can get cheaper with a club card price, but your club card price is what it used to be priced at anyway. So you can now get two bottles of Pepsi Max for £3, um, but they're £1.75 a bottle. So they're 25p more a bottle, but you can get them for the same price as you used to get them. So you're getting them for cheaper with your club card, but it's not really cheap because it's the same price as you were paying before anyway. Um, and sometimes 25p more a bottle because you were sometimes getting it for cheaper. Everything is just a club. They've done that quite a lot around Tesco's actually. Put put the prices up and then put the old prices um, as your club card price. So really you're not actually getting any more of a deal out of it because you're paying what it would have been costing you anyway. And if it had been on a club card price before, it would have been cheaper than that. So you're kind of paying more all round. It's very stressful going around the shops and seeing how much everything's gone up in price. Um, sorry, it's my shaky hand. Yeah, it's quite scary really when you sort of see it for yourself and realise it's even like, um, what else was it? What else was it that I said I could have got that cheap? Oh, discos. So a packet of discos. So a six pack of discos. No, um, they were actually 99p in Tesco's, but I bought them in Asda because they used to be a pound in Asda. £1.25 or £1.25 now. Um, packets of, you know, a six pack of squares in Tesco's was about £1.60 or something ridiculous like that. Um, everything's just gone up. Everything, every, You see the price on anything. And last night I was really angry because... Um, so the big bags of chocolate buttons, which I only eat at the weekend because I don't like to eat too much. It's my treat at the weekend. So I had a big bag of chocolate buttons <laughs> last night and I thought, where are all the buttons gone? So that I, it was, they're now £1.25 instead of a pound. Price of them went up. Um, but not only that, they're now only 95 grams in a bag. So they used to be one two five, I think. So... Not only are they 25p more, but you're 30 grams less. Mm. So essentially you're paying like... More for less. 50% more, really. Um, I was really angry. That's my chocolate buttons. Mm. Don't mess with things like that. And I was raging at 10 o'clock last night at my chocolate buttons. You get less you and you pay more. more. It's not on. But they've done that quite a lot. There's a word for that. I heard it on the news this morning. Is it shrinkflation? Inflation. No, shrinkflation is where they... Um, so they less than what's in the packet. So you're getting less in the packet. But you're paying, but you're paying more. more. Um, paying for more just, than what you just ridiculous. For. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Um, anyway, I'm going to unload this and let Ben put it all away. Right, that's Zoe home. So she just got home from shopping. Um, like I said to you before, guys, this is something that I'm going to do every single week now. Um, she does the, Zoe's decided that she's going to start doing the big shop, what we class as the weekly big shop every Saturday night because it, it works out easy for us. She can go about four o'clock while I'm doing tea for the kids and all that kind of stuff and then come back. And, and, and by the time she's come back, I've put all the little ones to bed and we're all in a good happy place to put all the shopping away and we're not rushing and all that kind of stuff so she spent 290 quid um she'll probably have to go again for a couple of little shops during the week to top up but essentially this is the big one this is the big shop that we do every week so should we uh let's get into it 
Okay, guys, so let's see what we've got then. So, so I'm literally just going to go from left to right, and then I'm going to do the bags down below, okay? So let's go from left to right then. So first off, oven chips. Big favourite of mine is Zoe's. We do like we do like oven chips and fish, fish and chips and, and the chicken burgers that I discussed on the uh, vlog last night, the chicken burgers that I make. So I'm following off that then, we've got the old um, bird's eye chicken nuggets. So we've got one pack of those uh, this week. So obviously we've got a few of those in the freezer. So there's three bags of alphabite lettuce, so, so potato lettuce. We've got three bags of those because um, that's something that the kids will eat um, when they're not having a corn, what we call like a corn meal, you know, what some, something like bolognese or whatever. So they'll, they'll be eating these and they're like Agnes's absolute favorite. Uh, what's that underneath there? So we've got sausages. Yep, sausages. Those are the hot. Those are the hot and spicy um, chicken burger fillets that me and Zoe put in. Well, I cu I cooked them up on a on a Wednesday night and, so and on a Saturday night as well. We'll have chicken burgers. So I use use the old brioche buns. Um, cook those up with hash browns and a bit of Nando sauce, and it's just amazing. It's a really lush meal, honestly. They're really nice. Uh, we've got waffles going around them. We've got the usual ham, chicken for sandwiches and wraps, cheese. We normally get through a block of that a week, believe it or not. So and sometimes more. So the kids have cheese sandwiches, cheese wraps, all that kind of stuff. So it, it just goes, uh, and we have it on pasta and stuff. Um, yogurts there. Joseph's favourite. He loves those yogurts. So do the twinnings. They have those for their breakfast. Um, cucumber, pepperamis, which are Eva's favourite. Fruits, which are normally going to pack lunches, and, and we do for lunches on the weekend. But uh, we've got plenty of milk-free butter for Agnes as well. We've got that in the fridge already. That's already in the fridge. So obviously, Zoe didn't get, need to get any of that today. Uh, green milk, because we just we normally just get the green filtered milk. I know it's a little bit more expensive, but um, the kids don't they just don't like the taste of the normal green milk. Um, so it's one of those things that we've discussed about before. Do we want the fuss of them not eat, not drinking the green milk or, or what? So so we just go for this. Um, fruit. Kids eat absolute tons of fruit. Especially like Isabel. She loves her blueberries, raspberries, strawberries. So that's a lovely treat there. So we'll get, the, we'll get those done tomorrow for lunch. Uh, going back then, Jaffa Cakes. We get through literally a box of these a week. Because what the kiddies do is they like to have those for um afters for like a dessert if you like so rather than having something like jelly and ice cream and all that kind of stuff in the week they'll just have like a couple of jaffa cakes as, as their afters and it's, it kind of, we're fine with that you know if that's what they want then that's fine because that works out easy for us if they just want to have something like that so that's cool so yeah we'll, we'll normally get like um, a box of 100 jaffa cakes um what else we got there strawberry yogurt flakes the usual bread so zoe's got three loaves of bread uh then we've got this oh this is that new stuff right so this is the meat and veg mince so it's like half meat half veg so we're going to give this a go um same with the sausages and the mince for for bolognese we're going to give that a go because we just think we don't eat a lot of meat anyway um and it looked quite nice and zoe, to zoe told us about it so we said well let's let's give it a shot then because i think it's a bit healthier and it's better carbon footprint and all that kind of stuff you know it saves rainforests and things so um, we're going to give that a shot, but we'll, re we'll report back and we'll let you know in next week's vlog if it is all right. Because if we don't buy that next week, then you know why. Right, moving on then. Usual biscuits. Um, these are like lunch fillers, pat lunch fillers. Uh, I think Zoe's bought these for like little snacks if, uh, if we get hungry in the week. Um, just want something a bit more healthier. Wraps. Burger buns, because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be doing the girls. I'm going I'm to do the kids. Uh, chicken burgers for tea tomorrow night they love those little bird's eye frozen chicken burgers um absolutely adore them so i'm going to do those for tea tomorrow night noodles she's done a noodles top up because i literally i've cooked noodles for them tonight and they had they used up five five packets normally use up seven but a couple of them are away so um we used up five so she's done a top up of those peanut butter for charlotte because she loves those spaghetti that kind of speaks for itself tuna because me and zoe love tuna sandwiches uh agnes's favorite prawn cocktail crisps um zoe's favorite squares and also they're also joseph's favorite and um i believe some of the others like them as well i think i think the twins like those uh discos are noah's favorite um and i think some of the other kids like discos as well and then there's what's that french fries my favorite golden wonder can't beat a golden wonder salt and vinegar snacker jacks because um 
well, Joseph and Agnes have those for snacks in the week. And so do the twins. They sometimes come in from school and have these snacker jacks, like one a pack of snacker jacks, and sometimes the big ones as well. But they're quite a healthy snack, aren't they, really? Going around then, so we've got garlic bread for bolognese for the kids. Then there's these garlic breads that me and Zoe have sometimes with pasta and things like that. So they're quite nice. Uh, cereal, that's just a top up, really. Um, how many boxes have we got there? So we've got Frosties, Cheerios, Choco Hoops, two boxes of Shreddies because they love Shreddies and some, I think that's more Cheerios because they're another favourite as well. That's just literally a top up for, for basically what's missing from the um, from the shelf. Going down then, um, two jars of Bolognese, two jars of Bolognese sauce will do all of the kids and me and Zoe. Uh, that'll do as a meal and then a little bit left over for, for possibly one in a frozen you know some some leftovers in the freezer um salad cream yeah who doesn't like that so um mayonnaise the usual um paper towel you know and what else have we got there we've got some sweeties so these are these aren't these aren't something that are trough these are something that they they could possibly have the the older ones normally have them as a snack or a treat sometimes uh the same as the whispers Noah loves his wagon wheels in his um, pack lunch. These bourbons, we get through loads of those, absolute loads of them, because Joseph loves them and Agnes loves them, and they're also uh, milk-free. If, if anyone didn't realise that, they're milk-free. Uh, more pack lunch fillers, what are they, Yorkie, Yorkie biscuits, and then the whole Tunnock's tea cakes, which Noah loves as well, so he likes those for his little pack lunch. Going around then, a million bog rolls, yeah, that goes without saying. Oh, it looks like someone's been buying some raise things to try out mm, give those a go and then there's the milk as well that Zoe's bought for um, baby Flo right then let's have a look in the bags so in the bags then we've got oh yeah yogurts uh oh, dental flosses in there kitchen foil mini rolls that looks like chocolate spread and mini oreos can you see those mini oreo packets Agnes and Joseph absolutely love those and they are milk free as well so if anybody didn't realize that they're milk free uh, toiletries, I ain't going to go through that because that's just a bag of toiletries, shower gel and all that kind of stuff. Um, some juice in there, I think there's some Mac B in there, some more Oreos, uh, which Agnes and Joseph like. And then the big Snacker Jacks, which Agnes and Joseph love as well. Coming in here then, we do let the kiddies have some apple juice in the mornings because they love having apple juice. I mean, me and Zoe have like a Barocca drink type thing in the morning, but they like their apple juice. So there's some apple juice in there, there's some um, olive oil, some ketchup. And I think that's our pasta sauces. Yeah, there's two pasta sauces in there as well, which Zoe and I like for our meals in the week as well. Um, I think that she, she, had, she had to get one of the posh olive oils this week because they, they just didn't have any on the shelves. That was all they had. Um, and we really needed some, so... Oh, well. Anyway, um, salads. Yeah, so we have salads in the sandwiches. So let's see, lettuce in the sandwiches. Then in there is more fruit, bananas, apples, grapes green and red grapes literally this fruit the fruit that you've seen on this haul will be gone in about two days honestly you, you've never seen any anything like it the kids are eating fruit which is good you know it adds up but it's good you know we can't really complain about it too much because why not it, at least they're eating healthfully you know uh then over here we've got oh yeah bleach uh squash dental spray another um Another Pepsi Max because that's the drink that me and Zoe like to drink. And then um, we've got some fizzy water, which I really like. I do like drinking a lot of water, but recently I, it's just drinking normal water out of the tap sometimes is really boring. But I do like it when it's a bit fizzy. So I, I normally have a cup of that with, with some ice, if you know what I mean. Oh, and I forgot to mention we've got more pop up there. So what we call pop is like um, Pepsi Max. And uh, that's what Zoe and I will drink normally with, with a meal or whatever. Uh, and then uh, other than that, it's, it's water, you know, all the fizzy water. So there you go, guys. That is our shopping of the week. Less a couple of things that, that I've put away already because I didn't want them to melt too much. Uh, ice lollies and stuff. But um, yeah, that is pretty much 290 quid for shopping done and dusted. So there you go guys, so intermingled with our normal Saturday vlog, that's what you, that's what you can expect now is a shopping haul um, of everything that Zoe gets for that evening, which I don't mind doing at all because I quite enjoy it. 
Um, let me know what you think. And um, yeah, I think that's it for today. So guys, really hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe to our channel. Please hit the bell for notifications. Drop us a like and a comment. Don't forget we've got memberships now. Uh, thank you for watching and all the comments that we do get because we really appreciate it. And um, we'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.